to solve the rank choice voting problem. So first thing we need to do is to import the CSV file. So we're going to import, you can choose upload because you're going to upload it from your computer. And we're going to drag the sample ranked votes file in. And we'll let this go. It's going to take a little bit. I'm going to, whoops. A little bit laggy internet here. All right. So I just wanted to center them because I found it easier. Now we want to count how many votes each of them got in the first round. And Excel and and uh, Google Sheets both have a count if function. So we can count, we want to say this is A2 to A21, right? And we could have done the same, instead of typing that, we could have just dragged. It's like out of everything in that range, If it equals one, we're going to count it. So there are seven votes for Haley. And then we can fill across four votes for Joseph, six votes for Brianna, and three votes for Trey. So Trey has the fewest votes. So if we go in here, we'll add a new, we'll call this round two. Come back here and copy these and paste it in here. Then we have to adjust these vote totals. So if we come down, we're going to be eliminating Trey. So in this line, where his first choices were, these all need to be reduced by one. And here, And you'll see the vote totals at the bottom are automatically updating. To be fair, we should also probably go in here and reduce these, not where he was where he was the first choice, but where he wasn't the last choice. We probably want to reduce the votes that come after him so that everything is down to one, two, threes. That looks good. So we can just delete tray. And now we have another we have another round of voting. Haley got nine votes, Joseph got five votes, and Brianna got six votes. So Joseph's gonna be eliminated and we're gonna follow that same procedure. We'll get a round three and we'll copy and paste those in. So that should give you